Hello friends, this is Jalpesh here and welcome again to this new video. In this video, we are going to see how we can do debugging with Angular 6 and uh, uh, with uh, Visual Studio Code. So Visual Studio Code is a very uh, good editor in terms of like uh, features, like there are lots of features and it's pretty lightweight. Uh, it's don't need uh, any introduction because like most of the people who are using Angular is uh, having uh, idea what is used to your code is so in this video what we are going to see how we can debug uh, our angular 6 app so first thing what i have done is if you see this command prompt so what i have created uh, is like i have created uh, my uh, app called uh, my super cool app with the command like ng new dash my super cool app so that is what uh, I already done to save the time. Now what I can do is uh, I can do uh, cd to my super cool app and let me run ng solve. So what it will do is like it will compile the Angular application. And from there, like it will serve this application on the localhost 4200. Here you can see that. So we are done with the compiling and let's run that app. I already started running, but like let me refresh it so to make sure that it has been working. So this is a great simple Angular app and here is the code structure for that so here you can see like uh, this is not a nothing fancy i have created a simple uh, app uh, with uh, angular 6 and uh, what i did is i have created this constructor and put it a console.log uh, steps to just make sure that like it, this constructor works so basically uh, to debug angular 6 you need two things uh, one is visual studio code then you need you already have your angular 6 cli installed if you don't have then then also no need to worry you can install it uh, via like uh, 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 via running the command uh, called uh, npm install angular cli so you, if you go to cli.angular.io uh, you can see like this is the command to run the angular so now uh, that is the angular cli there is one more extension which is needed so which is there uh, uh, let me show you that extension here so debugger for chrome so basically like you can debug this with uh, a chrome browser only so basically you need to have that chrome and this is a, a extension from microsoft you, you can see like it's it has got like massive downloads because like it is very useful and like instead of debugging all these stuffs into the browser uh, we can debug in our code editor itself and like you know that what is better than uh, debugging your code into code editor instead of like browser so let's see how it works okay so i have already created those stuff so this is the debug uh, panel there so what i did is like uh, i already added a configuration there uh, but like if you if you are doing first time then it will ask for your configuration things so here what I did is I have already added the configuration and I have put it my local host is 4200 because the thing is that like uh, it is the default port uh, from uh, the angular CLI so that's what we are doing and like uh, whatever uh, folder which we are in right now is our workspace folder so let's debug this thing okay so I am starting my this uh, debugging stuff. 
and here you can see like it's opening up new debugger and here you can see like it is uh, having uh, this app component uh, uh, debug point and from here like you can go to the next step or you can uh, step into or step in out so this is a proper debugger itself and it will also have like this watch and variable so here you can see my title variable this is the variable which is there and there are some like globals and closers are also there right now we don't have any uh, anything because like this is this is a pretty standard basic app there um, but like uh, once you have like lot more of things going on like this is like a pure goal like uh, trust me like i have created like many enterprise angular app and this is uh, going to save you a lot of time because like you you are going to debug your code into visual studio code so that is what i wanted to show you don't worry about this extension uh, i will uh, put these things in the youtube video description so don't worry about it and thank you for watching this video i hope you liked it if you liked it uh, then please do subscribe to my channel uh, there, there will be a subscribe uh, button there so please please do subscribe to my channel because i am going to put lot many videos with visual studio code which is one of the best editor and uh, um, uh, like there are technologies like golang node.js sp.net code so I, I i whatever i am learning these days uh, i am going to share with you guys so please keep subscribing to my video so that's it uh, thank you very much for your patience and time and again thank you for watching this video